Hello everyone. So in this video, I will discuss some industrial applications of enzymes. So without any delay, let's start the video. So before going into the applications, uh, let me first clear that what are enzymes. So as you know, enzymes are some biological molecules or catalysts. They just speed up the reaction. They just increase the rate of reaction by lowering the energy of activation. So simply enzymes just increase the speed of a reaction. Now let's discuss the industrial applications of enzymes. The first application of enzyme is in detergent industry. So enzymes are also used in detergent industry for the various purpose like first example is proteases. So these are used to remove protein stains from the fabric. So that's why proteases are added to detergent so that they can easily remove some protein stains from the garments. Then second example is lipases. So they just remove the lipid stains from the fabric. Then next example is cellulases. So it digests the small fiber that sometimes arises in the fabric. So these cellulases, they just digest the small fibers. Next example, amylases. So they are used to remove the starchy stains from the fabric because these enzymes, they digest the hydroglycosidic bonds of the, you can say this starch and hence remove the starchy stains. And next is mayonnaise. So it is used to remove the mannan stain from the fabric because it hydrolyzes the insoluble mannan into the soluble mannose and which can be easily removed from the uh, fabric. So these are some applications in the detergent industry. Second, the use of enzyme in the food industry. So here are certain examples like first is Renet. So this enzyme is used for the milk clotting and in the cheese making process. Second example is lipase. So they are used to enhance the flavor of cheese. Next is lactase. So they are used to remove the lactose from the milk. By using this enzyme, we can remove the lactose from the milk. Another example is pepain and this is used to tenderize the meat. So in the meat industry, this pepain is used, which is used to just, you can say, soften the meat. And next is pectinases. So they are used in the some fruit based product because they are used to clarify the fruit juices. So that's why they are used in the fruit based products. Next application of enzyme in the paper and pulp industry. So here are certain examples like first is amylases. So these are used to you can say just use for the uh, starch coating, de-inking and drainage of uh, you can say by this we can also improve the drainage. Next, lipases. So they are used to separate the pitch from the pulp and for the contamination control also. Next, proteases. So these are used for the biofilm removal because when we use certain, you can say certain microbes in the paper and pulp industry, so their my biofilm is removed by these proteases. And next example is xylenase. So they are used in the uh, bleaching process to boost up the bleaching. The next use of enzyme is in the beverages industry. So here are certain examples like first amylases. So they are used for the clarification of juice and you can say just to make the low calorie beer. The next example is pectinase. So they are used for the depectinization and meshing. Next example is beta gluconase. It is used in the meshing process during the formation of beer. Next, that is acetolactate decarboxylase. So they are used in the maturation process of beer. And finally, the lacase, they are used in the clarification and also to enhance the flavor in the beer. Next application of enzyme is in the textile industry. So here are certain examples like first is the cellulase. So they are used in the denim finishing and cotton softening. Second lacase, they are used in the bleaching process. Third example is peroxidase. They are used to remove the excess dyes from the fabric. And then pectate lysis. So they are used in the scoring process. So by this scouring process, we just make our surface more hydrophilic. Now next, the use of enzyme in the leather industry. So generally in the leather industry, we perform certain tasks like soaking, which is used to improve the water uptake. Then dehairing make means we just remove the hair from the leather. It makes the surface clean and spotless and soft. Degreasing just to remove the grease from the leather and batting just to make leather soft and easier to dye. So all these 
प्रोसेस इज दे यूज द एंजाइम दैट इज प्रोटेजिज एंड लाइपेजिज सो वेरियस प्रोटेजिज एंड लाइपेजिज आर यूज इन द लेदर इंडस्ट्री so next is the use of enzyme in medicine so certain enzymes are used for the treatment of many diseases like first of all the enzyme is asparaginase so it is used in the treatment of leukemia so leukemia is a blood cancer in which there is a increase in the uh, number of white blood cells next example is hyaluronidase so it is used in case of heart attack next lysozyme so they have the property to kill the bacteria so that's why they use as antibiotic to treat the infection next ribonuclease so these have some antiviral activity means they just kill the virus or you can say they just stop the viral growth so that's why they use as antiviral agents next streptokinase so it is used in case of blood clotting then trypsin it is used to treat the inflammation then urokinase it is also used to treat the blood clots so this was all about some interested application of enzymes so that's over today guys see you in the next video